welcome to Town Hall Farm TV. I'm Allison Hall. Today I want to talk to you about taking care of your horse's feet with Venice Turpentine. So I like to use this um, a couple times a week, maybe three to four times a week. What I do is I buy the Venice Turpentine here. It's about $11 in the can. And I actually purchased a turpentine warmer. You can buy a, a, a flat uh, coffee hot plate and heat it up the same way. However, I bought this um, at FarmVet. It's about $94. And again, you just place your turpentine in the heater, plug it in, turn it on high, and that makes the turpentine a lot easier for you to apply to the sole and the frog of the foot. The nice thing about turpentine is a couple things. Number one, it helps with the horse's sole, sole toughen up. So if you know you're going to a big horse show over the weekend, it's really good to make sure that you uh, apply that to the sole and the frog of the foot. Um, it also has an antiseptic uh, component to it. As you know, bacteria, bacteria um, definitely thrives in wet environments, and, and the hoof is an area where bacteria tends to grow. So let me show you how I apply Venice Turpentine to the horse's hoof. So first what you want to do is make sure you clean your horse's hoof and get it nice and clean. Clean alongside the frog as well as along the wall of your horse's hoof. Really making sure that the hoof is nice and clean. And you want to open up the turpentine. And simply paint it over the sole and the frog of the foot. It can be a bit sticky, so you'd like to wear gloves so you don't get it all over you. After I'm done applying the turpentine, I like to put the horse back in the stall and let the horse sit and have shavings that kind of pack into the hoof there because that helps that turpentine set into the horse's hoof. So that's it for today at Town Hall Farm TV. Thanks for watching. I look forward to any comments and suggestions.